This uh, TA Tech tip will explain how to install and calibrate the major probes on the TMA Q400 thermomechanical analyzer. TMA measures expansions of materials in a temperature range from minus 150 to 1000 degrees Celsius. The main applications will be the determination of the coefficient of thermal expansion, the glass transition temperature and the determination of softening points. For higher temperature applications, we also have dilatometers, which can measure CTE up to 2,800 degrees Celsius. This is the TMA Q400. It consists of a mechanical part and a furnace. We will open the furnace from the touch screen by clicking Furnace Open Apply. Then for easy access, we can turn it backwards this way, and here, we have the sample stage where the sample will sit with a probe on it and the thermocouple which will measure the temperature of the sample for the measurement. So we have the major probes here, three of them. The expansion probe for a CTE determination, it's flat. We have the macro expansion probe which is flat also but with a higher surface for softer materials. And we have the penetration probe, also made in quartz, with a tip here for a softening point determinations. So we will take the probe and introduce from behind in the sample stage. We will lower it slowly inside the mechanical part of the instrument. And when it's close to the end, we will open the weight tray, lock it like that, and let the probe go down until the, it sits completely inside the mechanical part. We can align, align it like that, and then we will turn the knob here to lock it in place inside the instrument. Slowly, carefully, we will put it down on the sample stage, close the weight train, and it's ready to calibrate. For better results, it's recommended to close the furnace, but for the video, I will let it like that so you can see what is doing the probe during the measurement. So, to calibrate the probe, we will go to Calib on the touch screen of the Q400 and we will choose Probe. We have a reminder to clear the weight tray here if anything is in place. And when it's ready, we push the Go button. First, a zero will be made and probe calibration is in progress. Then the instrument calibrates the LVDT, which is a displacement measurement. Then the probe, the probe will move up and down inside the LVDT, as you can see now. It's a bal balancing part of the calibration process. And now we come back to standby and the probe calibration is completed.